Enjoy your home at Purdue and play it safe like Purdue Pete. Today's topic, safe walk. Hey, Purdue Pete. Boy, am I glad to see you. It was getting dark from my walk back from class. I was getting a little scared. Cool. Lions, tigers. And bears, oh, oh my. my. Lions and tigers and bears, oh my. Lions and Purdue tigers Pete and always bears. springs into action when he spots someone walking alone at night. Always walk on lighted pathways. Walk in pairs or groups. Purdue Pete says use the emergency telephone system located throughout campus. Watch Purdue Pete demonstrate. He looks for a blue light, opens the door, and pushes the button. The Purdue Dispatch Center will answer and send help. Police department. Wherever you roam, use a buddy to get home. Unless you happen to carry a really large hammer. Remember, keep your cell phone handy in case you feel your personal safety is in jeopardy. Always be like Purdue Pete. Practice safety. The surveys show that the majority of the student body said that they feel safer with the call boxes around on campus. However, a majority of these students are not aware about how to use this life-saving resource. The surveys also reflect that the fact that most of the people have never used these call boxes, but a small minority did use this resource once. And this is what the 300 emergency call boxes on campus are about saving people's life in case of extreme situations. According to the campus newspaper Purdue Exponent, these skull boxes were used 200 times last year. The best thing about the service is that the police guarantees that help would arrive within a couple of minutes because as soon as the button on any of these emergency call boxes is pressed, the Purdue police department also receives the location of the victim. The university has uh, roughly uh, 250 ETS boxes here on campus. Uh, upon activation of those boxes, it is standard protocol for the police department to respond to make sure there's no problems in the area. Well, the one thing that um, really stood out to me was they have like those emergency boxes way more often than a lot of other universities. Purdue's campus has 250 call boxes in less than two square miles. News Channel 18 took a short walk around the Stewart Center and found four immediately. At first, it may not seem like the boxes are working. There is no dial tone or ring once the button is pushed. There's only silence until a police dispatcher answers. Purdue Police Captain Eric Chin demonstrated how they work. Police Barber Ridge. The boxes call only one place. It rings right into the police station. And with a call comes an officer. Whether you speak into the box or not, it's protocol for us to dispatch an officer to the vicinity of the call box. The Purdue Student Patrol checks the boxes monthly to make sure each one works properly. Students say it's nice to know the boxes are there, but some say they're only a backup option. They definitely help, you know, if you don't have your cell phone on your instead or something. It's definitely a comfort knowing that they're around. Students also say they need to take personal responsibility for staying safe, like walking together in groups. Sky